Hello guys, when we was talking about live test, we mentioned about this, these two types of pings here, the TCP ARC service ping and TCP SYN service ping. So now I want to go deep and explain you this. Okay, so to understand this, you need to understand first this diagram here, this three-way handshake diagram. When you want to send or a client want to send a package or contact the server before he send the package, the, he must know and make sure that the server is up. So what happened first is this, this three way handshake. We have here the client in left side, in the right side, we have the server. So the client will, will send a scene message to the server. And if the server is online, the server will send a scene arc to the client and the client will send ARC message to the server. And after this, the connection will be established, all right? But when the server is not online, this will end here, okay? This, the client will send a scene to the server and after that, will, will there, there will be no response because the server is offline, okay? So now I want to explain you this using Nmap and Wireshark, okay? Let's go here. I want to explain you the difference of these two right now let me minimize it and let's go here so here let's type this command sudo and map and let's use this command first hyphen st and let's provide the ip so what will happen this this command here represents tcp arc service ping okay this st represents that test and this is my windows machine so now let's go and hide enter to see the results all right you see this result here so now let me type again sudo and map and instead of use this one i will use this one iphen s uppercase s and i will provide my windows machine and this represents this one tcp scene service ping okay and let's go here and hide enter so here if you see looks like there is no difference between these two scans scan report host is up we have the ports here. We have the same information here. Okay. So let's rerun this command, but now using Wireshark. Okay. The Wireshark is a software used to analyze data in their network. Okay. So now I want to use Wireshark and I will I'll run this command first and we will see the difference. All right. Let's go to this icon, Kali icon application, and let's go to sniffing and Spotify. Select Wireshark, provide Kali machine password and click authenticate white shark will open okay and let's go to this icon here and start capturing package just click minimize it and so now let's run this command again this one st the tcp arc all right the scan is done okay let's go to white shark now and let's stop it so now what we need to do you need to scroll scroll down or up until you find this red line here all right so here in the source you need to select your kali machine ip just select it in this column here source right click and go to follow and click tcp stream okay just close this this tab here close and as you can see here this is tcp arc all right so here you have the source and you have the destination and we have here the information okay so here my kali machine send a message to my windows machine send a scene message and my windows machine replied with this scene arc and then my kali machine send another message to destination to my windows machine with arc all right and then connection was ended all right so this is the three-way handshake okay but this type of scan sometimes can be blocked by the firewall okay so that's why we suggest to use another type of scan okay so let's do this let's clear here and let's start capture files continue without saving and now let's go to our terminal and let's run this command now let's hit enter okay we have the result let's go to shark and let's stop and let's scroll down at, until we find the red line we found here the red line as you can see just right click and go to follow and tcp stream just close it as you can see here in this type of scan we have here 
my Kali machine sending a SYN message to the destination, the Windows machine, and the Windows machine, when the Windows machine here replies with SYN ACK, the connection is ended. The Kali machine sends a SYN to the Windows machine, the Windows machine replies with SYN ACK. As soon as the, the Kali machine knows that the Windows machine is up, it ends the connection. Don't want to send any package. Just want to know if the host is online or not. That's why I, I suggest you to use this option here. This with this iPhone SS to avoid the blocking by the firewall. Okay, see you in next lesson.